In this video, Timmy's going to show you how to move the taskbar on a Chromebook. So the taskbar on a Chromebook is actually called the bookshelf, and it's this little bar at the bottom of the screen here where it shows your apps and the time and other things like that. And by default, it's always across the bottom of the screen, but you can actually change it to be any position you want. So to move the taskbar or the bookshelf on your Chromebook, all you need to do is right click on an empty space on the bar. So you can't right click on an app like this. You'll need to right click on an empty space like this. And if you're using a mouse, you'll just need to click on the right click button to bring up this menu. Or if you're using a trackpad, you'll just need to click down on the trackpad with two fingers at the same time. And that will do the same thing. And then in this menu, you'll just need to come up and hover over shelf position. And now you'll see it's set to bottom because it's on the bottom. But if you want to make it on the left or on the right, you'll just need to click on left or right like this. And now the bar moves up here straight away. So now rather than being down the bottom here, it's over the side here and you can still click on these apps like you normally would. And you've still got the time and the Wi-Fi indicators and stuff here that you can click on. So it's all the same, except it's been moved to the right side. And if you wanted to, if you'd right click on it again and hover over shelf position, you can choose right side and now it's all on the right side. Or if you decide you don't like it, you can right click on it again, hover over shelf position and click on bottom and it will go back to normal. So that's all there is to moving the bookshelf, but you can actually make it auto hide every time an app is open if you like. So to do that, you just need to right click on the shelf again and then come up here and click auto hide shelf. And now it will still stay here because nothing is open. But if you open up Google Chrome here and go into Google Chrome, whenever your mouse is not down the bottom of the screen, the shelf will disappear. As you can see, it's disappeared now. So that means you've got a bit more space to work with on the screen to do whatever you want in Google Chrome or any other app. And then whenever you need the shelf to click on something, you just need to move your mouse cursor down to the bottom like this and it will reappear. But Timmy's not really a fan of this. Timmy prefers to have it there all the time. So Timmy will just right click on it again and click on always show shelf. And now the shelf is always there. So that's all there is to it. That's how you can move your shelf and how you can make it auto hide if you want. So that's really cool. And hopefully you found this video helpful. And if you did, please click on the thumbs up button down below. And if you want to see more videos like this, click on the subscribe button down below and click on the little bell icon next to the subscribe button to be notified every time Timmy makes a new video. So that's really cool. And Timmy will see you in the next video.